Hello, everybody. Welcome to another uh, video on the Observed Intelligence channel. My name is Hospital Yadi, and today we're going to talk about how we can draw well sticks on on in like in Plotly and on a map. So, with that being said, let's go ahead and start importing some uh, some libraries. Let's import uh, NumPy as MP. Import pandas as PD. Uh, let's import, uh, let's see, matplotlib, matplotlib.pyplot as PLT. Uh, let's also import seaborn as SNS, percent matplotlib in line to see all these figures inside of Jupyter Notebook. Let's do set uh, SNS dot set style and set the style to dark grid. And let's go ahead and do import uh, plotly um, dot express as PX. So if you have not downloaded the plotly library, on your computer, you can always do pip install um, Plotly and uh, that should take care of that. Uh, so also do sns.set, let's do the font scale of uh, 1.2, for example. And let's run this, it ran successfully. Let's go ahead and import a an Excel that has um, five columns in it. It has a generic well name, it has the latitude or the surface latitude, surface longitude, uh, bottom hole latitude, and bottom hole longitude for each of those generic wells. So let's go ahead and import that file, pd.read. Uh, it's an Excel, so underscore Excel. The name of the file is latitude, um, is latitude uh, underscore longitude. Run that. And let's go ahead and do df dot head and um, visualize look look at the data that we have so you can see here well name latitude longitude uh, uh, bottom hole latitude and bottom hole longitude so now let's go ahead and try to plot all these wells on a map so let's go ahead and import um, plotly dot graph underscore objects as go and um i can actually just come down right in the same same uh, same line and just say uh we can just say create a figure we can do that by saying fig is equal to go dot uh figure like that and we can go down and next i and the next step is to iterate iterate over uh, the rows of a uh, of the data frame basically data frame and let's go ahead and say for i row uh, we can do in df which is the uh, which is our data frame dot there's a, a function called um, iter rows um, you can actually see the function here, iter uh, rows. Uh, actually, it's um, uh, this this function right here, and uh, colon, and then go down. Uh, so the next step is we need to get uh, the uh, surface and bottom hole co coordinates, the surface and and bottom hole coordinates. So now what we can do is uh, go down here and say, uh, first off, let's call it surface latitude or call it like surface underscore LAT, lat, and say row. Uh, it's gonna be uh, the name of the column is latitude, latitude like that. And then we can do the same thing for uh, longitude. So what we can do, we can copy and paste this, come down and say surface, 
longitude. Uh, actually, let's call it like surface L O N, and call this instead of latitude, call it longitude, right? And then next is what we want to do is we want to copy and paste again these two two lines, just for uh, simplicity, and just say um, instead of uh, surface latitude, we can say uh, bottom hole. B H uh, bottom hole, and then also same thing here. Bottom hole, and call it. Um, this is latitude. Uh, the name of the column is latitude bottom hole, uh, latitude or uh, longitude uh, bottom hole. So basically, we have defined surface latitude as the latitude column, uh, surface longitude as the longitude column, uh, bottom hole latitude as uh, latitude bottom hole, and then bottom hole longitude as bottom hole as longitude uh, BH. So now the next step is within the same for loop, we can come down and say, um, add, uh, add the well sticks uh, to, to the figure. So with that, so now we can go down again within the same for loop. We can say fig dot add and uh, add a trace, and we can say go dot scatter, go dot scatter, and uh, basically define um, x. X is going to be defined as um, surface uh, longitude, surface L O N like what we defined above. And then also we can define uh, bottom hole longitude. So bottom hole um, LON like that, which we define these two here. We got surface uh, longitude and bottom hole uh, longitude. So these are the X's. And then now let's define Y. Y is going to be equal to uh, let's just say y is going to be, again, we're going to have bracket. So instead of, uh, we can just honestly copy and paste this uh, right here. And instead of surface longitude, we can say surface uh, latitude, surface LAT. And then instead of bottom hole, uh, we can, uh, longitude, we can say bottom hole LAT. And, uh, and then what we can do is uh, we can do, uh, line uh, line is equal to uh, uh, dictionary and do color uh, color by for example do um, uh, we can do brown and uh, then we can put a comma let's come down here say name is equal to row and then uh, we can uh, define the row by well name, which is the name of the column. And then uh, once we're done with that, then next side, the next is to come out here and and say uh, set the access, set the access uh, labels and title, and we can just set it as figure um, dot update uh, layout. And um, yep, layout. Uh, and then we can define it as x x axis, x axis uh, title as longitude. We can define the y axis, y axis uh, title title as um, latitude. And we can define title as well spacing, or well, well sticks, for example, in this case. Um, and then we can just give it a width of 900 and a height of, for example, uh, 700 or eight, let's just say 700. And um, last step is just to show the plot, show 
the plot and we can just say fig dot show and that should take care of uh, plotting the well sticks um so it says there's an error um so let's look into the error So um, yeah, so it, it's saying uh, uh, dictionary is not defined. There's a, just a small typo here. I just need to add a T. There we go. Now, now it makes sense. So if I run this now, there we go. So I have all the wells here. These are wells A, B, C, D, just as generic names. And I have all of the uh, well sticks on a map. And you can zoom in uh, within this plotly. And uh, basically, yeah, this is, uh, this is, um, the process of plotting well sticks on a map using the uh, uh, Plotly, um, using the Plotly library, which is very powerful. Again, very simple, a few lines of code, and you're able to draw these well sticks on a map, and on on as a, as far as the latitude and longitude. Uh, if this if you found this video helpful, um, give it a, give it a thumbs up and uh, like and share this content and uh, subscribe to the channel for more educational videos. Um, thank you so much.